Hello friends, Caleb Chevalier here. I'm at the Humane Society of Central Texas. I'm with Brooke and we have a special uh, a special guest with us today. Brooke, who is this? <laughs> this is our sweet girl, Noelle. <laughs> she is one of our resident old ladies here at the shelter. And as you can see, she is as sweet as can be. Yes. <laughs> she has been charming the socks out of all of us. Um, and we already have a special spot for our seniors in our heart around here. And so we are looking to get her home for the holidays. And, and she is a senior, and what when we talk about an age group of a senior, what kind of age group is that? Yeah, so that, uh, in our considerations, is gonna be any dog over five years old. Mm -hmm. We don't know too much about Noelle's history as a stray, but we do believe that she is around five to seven even, maybe even a little bit older. Uh, one of the lovely things about her is that she still has a good perk in her step, yes. so she has all of the luxuries of getting over that puppyhood stage. She is calmer, she is more collected than some of those crazy little guys. Um, and so she is an excellent addition to quite any family of being more mindful of the little ones in the home <laughs> while still hey, having enough energy to go for long walks, yes. have some fun play time as well. And you know, I, mean, I guess there's a little bit of apprehension with some people about adopting at the older ages, but she's got so much life left in her, doesn't she? Absolutely. She still has plenty of years to add love to a home. Yes. And like you were saying, she'd be just about a good fit with so many families. Yeah, we believe that she would be good with children. Um, we have gotten her into some of our gentle, dainty doggy groups. So if you have a pack of your own, she would be able to more than likely work herself into that pack. We always love doing meet and greets on site for any home dogs with shelter dogs, just to make sure those personalities mesh. And lastly, you know, we do have the holidays coming up and I hear there are some big things in store here. Yeah, so this Saturday, December 9th, we are hosting a Christmas time celebration here at the shelter, helping every animal here at the shelter find a home for the holidays. We are going to have food trucks, we're gonna have vendors, we're gonna have even Santa here to take pictures, all to make it a special occasion and help uh, create some awareness about whether you may be able to bring a furry family family member mm -hmm. into your home just in time for the holidays. And she is truly a sweetheart. So this is Noelle. We love for someone to find her and take her home and give her the home that she deserves. Brooke, thank you so much. Thank you. Sweet Noelle. I love that. I bet the pups are going to also like that visit from Santa as yes, well. Yes, yeah. Yes. She and was great. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, she was a lot more energized, though, which is funny because right. she's an older dog. And she's the older of the two that yeah, I talked to. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, you never know. Uh -huh. Now, the good thing about the Humane Society is they do host those meet and greets. Right. So if you're, you know, kind of nervous about everything and don't want to, like, officially adopt, mm -hmm. you can always go up there and hang out and yeah. see whoever you like. It's, uh, it's kind of like a trial run. You know, get mm -hmm. your pets to meet the others and see if it's a fit, and hopefully it will be. Yeah.